Okay. I think that's good to go. Hello everybody. Here I am again, filming from my kitchen, <laughs> taking a break from studying as per usual. Now today, I actually really wanted to do a video about kind of who does the Prime Minister of India, his name's Modi, who does he like more, Kamala or Trump? Now the reason why I mention this with my sources in the description box um, below, by the way, geez, what's, ugh, you ever run your hand through your hair and you're like, oh God, it's greasy and disgusting. Anyway, who does he like more? The reason why this is important is because India is an increasing power in the region and globally. And so we'd probably want to stay on like good relations with him, right? And so it's kind of like, hmm, who's he going to like more? Who could, what can we expect moving forward? Sources in the description box, if I didn't already mention that, which I don't think I already did. Also, there's someone screaming outside, so I apologize if you guys can hear that. It's, I don't know what's going on out there. Anyway, so I'm going to break this down. We're going to talk about like, let's talk culturally social policy, and let's talk about kind of everything else. So economic and political policies, those sorts of things to understand what we can expect. Well, in terms of social policy, Modi is a hyper conservative. I mean, you mentioned gay marriage around him and he's going to, you know, laugh as he tries to kill somebody as a result of that. It's a big deal. He is known to be one of Trump's greatest supporters. And when I mean greatest, I mean he's on record many times over being a massive Trump ally. Trump even had a 36-hour stay in India, and they had a meeting together that filled up a 100,000-person stadium, which is pretty significant. On the other hand, Kamala Harris, the reason why I mention her is because her heritage is partially from India, so it's a big deal. So Modi will come out and say something like, I'm going to read you a couple quotes, which originally is going to make you think, well, hold on a second here. Is any point blankly saying he loves Kamala? It's like, well, what he says is one thing. However, we will also have to look at their policies because if you like somebody, but you also can't support any policies they support, how much do you actually like them? So he says, and I quote, her being vice president is pathbreaking and a matter of immense pride. And then he directly says something to her, which is quote, I'm confident that the vibrant India US ties will get even stronger with your support and leadership, even the author. The opposition party in India even likes Kamala Harris. His name, I'm going to apologize, I'm going to butcher the Jesus out of this, but his name is Adhir Ranjan Chowdhury. And uh, he claims that Kamala is India's daughter, like quote unquote. And uh, so, okay, you got that. Trump's got the social policy, Kamala's got the heritage. I would say it's going to come down to policy for policy. And if, uh, if Trump wins that, then... I mean, clearly they're going to, Trump is going to do better than Kamala. And then we can expect have a degradation. Side note, as I'm digging up some policies over here, YouTube cut my recommendations for my videos down by 70% because they consider me to be controversial media, even though my sources are in the description box, I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. So if you can subscribe, I'd appreciate it. Okay. So I'm going to label some policies and you're going to take a guess and say, is this from the Obama-Biden administration, which is likely going to be replicated by Kamala, or is this from the Trump administration? Increased business investments in India, which resulted in the exportation of, or exporting of tens of thousands of American jobs. The increased efforts to balance China and an increase in drone strikes against their mortal enemy, Pakistan, which, I mean, they bombed the holy, the U.S., being they bombed the holy corral out of Pakistan, which resulted in essentially a buffet of death. So what do you think? Was that Obama's policy or was that Trump's? Because that sounds like that would be something Modi would support. Correct answer? Both administrations. They both did this. And so that's when they're even, Trump and Kamala. And so then it comes down to heritage. Honestly, I think it comes down to that and that would be Kamala. So I think he's going to like Kamala more. They're going to be supporting the exportation, I think that's a word, of tens of thousands of jobs, increased drone strikes. And uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So let me know what you think. Otherwise, um, happy, uh, happy fall.